Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I am going to tell you a very good digital electronics interview question. And the question is, what is the name of that well-known digital logic which acts as a one hot counter? Friends, if you know the answer, please write down in the comment section. If you do not know the answer, please try to think of it and you can take your time. Okay, let me explain you the answer. In this uh, example, I have taken a 4-bit 1-hot counter. So as the name indicates, its output will be 1-hot encoded. So 1-hot encoded means, out of these 4 bits, 1 bit will be high at a given point of time. So let us say its reset value is 0001. So this 1-hot encoded value is equivalent to decimal 0. And in the next clock cycle, this 1 will be shifted to Q1 and all the other bits will be 0 and this 1 hot encoded value is equivalent to decimal 1. Similarly, when this 1 is shifted to the position Q2 and all the other bits are 0, this 1 hot encoded value is equivalent to decimal 2 and so on. And finally, after 3, it will repeat its the decimal value 0 so the value will become 0, 0, 0, 0001 friends now i am going to reveal you the answer of the question the question was what is that famous and well known digital logic which acts as one hot counter and the answer of the question is ring counter yes my dear friends ring counter acts as one hot counter so 4 bit Ring counter will act as 4-bit 1-hot counter. The output of flip-flop FF0 will be the LSB of 1-hot counter. And output of FF3 that is Q3 will be the MSB of 1-hot counter. And the reset value of flip-flop 0 that is Q0 will be 1. And the reset value of the flip-flop 1, 2 and 3 will be 0. As you can see that I have connected this reset input signal to the preset of flip-flop 0 and this reset input is connected to clear of the remaining flip-flops so that I can get the output of flip-flop 0 as high with the reset signal. Friends, all the flip-flops in this diagram are negative edge triggered flip-flops. So with negative edge on this clock signal, this one will be passed to the output of uh, flip-flop 1 and Q3 which was 0 will be passed to the output of flip-flop 0 and Q0 will become 0 and Q1 will become 1 Q2, Q3 will also remain 0 similarly on the next negative edge of the clock this Q1 will be passed to Q2 and all the other bits Q3, Q0 and Q1 will remain 0. Similarly, this Q2 will be passed to Q3 on the next negative clock edge and Q0, Q1, Q2 will remain 0. And in the next clock edge, this Q3 will be passed to the output of Q0. In that case, Q1, Q2, Q3 will remain 0. It got its original reset value. So in the same way, it keep on rotating and giving us the one hot encoded value and act as one hot counters. Friends, with this, I am going to end this video. I hope this video would be informative for all of you. And this is my request to all those who have not subscribed my channel yet. Please subscribe it. And for the notification of similar videos, don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you so much for watching.